How do you feel? I, uh... I know you're not sleeping. We'll get to that. Why don't you come and have a sit this time? Maybe I'll stand. Well, suit yourself. I felt like sitting. I know. So. Let's get the obvious stuff out of the way. You're not human, are you? Well, it's tough to get any more obvious than that. If I had to guess, I'd say you're a program from the machine world. So is he. So far, so good. But if that's true, that could mean you are part of this system. Another kind of control. Keep going. I suppose the most obvious question is, how can I trust you? Bingo. It is a pickle, no doubt about it. Bad news is there's no way if you can really know whether I'm here to help you or not. So it's really up to you. Just have to make up your own damn mind to either accept what I'm going to tell you or reject it. Candy? You already know if I'm going to take it? Wouldn't be much of an oracle if I didn't. But if you already know, how can I make a choice? Because you didn't come here to make the choice. You've already made it. You're here to try to understand why you made it. Where the hell did they go? These are back doors, aren't they? Program releases. I thought you'd have figured that out by now. How do they work? The code is hidden in tumblers. One position opens a lock. And another position opens one of these doors. Are you a programmer? Then what are you? I protect that which matters most. I need a moment with you. I literally just walked in. Please. I assume that you were present during this latest act of insubordination. I was. You were in charge of the recall. How could you let this happen? What do you expect me to do, shoot him? Yeah, you'd save me the trouble. Jason, you can have my testimony at the debriefing. I don't want your testimony. What do you want? Your help. Does he do it? Is it because of us? I've spoken to the other captains and I wanted to offer you the chance to explain your actions. I wasn't aware that my actions required any explanation. You were given a direct order to return to Zion. I did. But you asked for one ship to remain behind. I would have stayed, but I needed to recharge my ship. So you admit to a direct contravention of your duty. It has nothing to do with you or me. Morpheus does what he believes he has to do. Then I'll do what I have to. You can. Why? Because you need him. The hell I do! Commander, we need a presence inside the Matrix to await contact from the Oracle. I don't want to hear that shit! I don't care about oracles or prophecies or messiahs. I care about one thing. Stopping that army from destroying this city. And to do that, I need soldiers to obey my orders. Jason, can you honestly tell me what went through your mind when you saw the tape from the Osiris? Exactly. I thought the same thing anybody from this city would. Every damn one of them. Except him. With all due respect, Commander, there is only one way to save our city. How? Neo. God damn it, Morpheus. Not everyone believes what you believe. My beliefs do not require them to. Morpheus believes we will win this war. He makes other people believe it too. And that's why you need him. How about you? Do you need him? All I need is a hot shower and something to eat that requires teeth. Thank you for your candor, Captain. Anytime, Commander. Can I see you tonight?
Why are you here? Same reason. I love candy. But why help us? We're all here to do what we're all here to do. I'm interested in one thing, Neo, the future. And believe me, I know, the only way to get there is to get there. But if that's true, that could mean you're a part of this system. Another kind of control. Keep going. I suppose the most obvious question is, how can I trust you? Bingo. It is a pickle, no doubt about it. Bad news is there's no way if you can really know whether I'm here to help you or not. So it's really up to you. Just have to make up your own damn mind.